Hi, I'm Megan Gallagher with Pacific Bearing Company, the new PBC Linear. We're at AT Expo and we're featuring some new products of ours including linear actuators and our new patent pending Integral V technology. So we're going to go ahead and show you some of those new products and first I'd like to tell you a little bit about the history of Pacific Bearing Company. Pacific Bearing Company is a manufacturer of linear motion components in Roscoe, Illinois. The company was started in 1982 and our specialty is providing solutions in linear motion and to provide a low-cost alternative to some of the standard linear motion components used today. We've also introduced systems as a part of our offering and we'll go over that later on. We're best known for the simplicity bearing, otherwise called the little red bearing, that was first introduced with Pacific Bearing Company as a solution to ball bearings that were causing failure and seizure in linear applications. And uh, the simplicity bearing is a self-lubricating technology that is very, very hardy and in difficult and dirty environments and performs extremely well in clean environments. So we like to call it the Jekyll and Hyde of bearings. Uh, in a ball bearing application, if you're in a very dirty environment, um, that dirt and contamination can get into the ball cage and can cause seizure, whereas there are no internal moving parts with the simplicity bearing. So as it's self-lubricating and doesn't require lubrication and also contains no moving parts, it is a great fit for a lot of linear applications where you're experiencing downtime and costly, uh, costly uh, machine you know, shutdowns. So that's one of our first products. So what we did was we took a look at that technology and the success that it had for us and for our customers in decreasing downtime and increasing productivity through quality and we applied that to a number of other products that uh, were directly uh, dimensionally interchangeable with some of the industry standards that include the ball cages. Um, so we started expanding in that direction and then recognizing the fact that sometimes you do need a ball technology. We introduced uh, gothic arch rollers and carriages and rails that would satisfy you know, some of those uh, other environments where a ball bearing technology was really necessary. And that takes us to today. Um, recognizing that in our economy today, uh, U.S. manufacturers particularly are looking to decrease their costs, increase their productivity, and remain competitive in the world market, the global market that we have today. So we've introduced some new technologies that I'd like to talk about that uh, solve those issues, provide solutions at a cost that uh, U.S. manufacturers can afford to remain competitive in the global market. This year marks a very exciting time for us and the introduction of two new product technologies. First is the linear actuator technologies. We've introduced belt-driven and ball-screw-driven linear actuators. And uh, this, what you're looking at here is an XY configuration with both actuators in play. First, we'll talk about the PL series, which is our ball-screw actuator in this, in this demonstration. It's a high-speed cam roller design. A uh, ball or lead screw driven, it's fully enclosed, it's got an aluminum anodized housing with an integral V rail technology, we'll talk about that next. It's also got standard T-slots for ease of mounting, uh, it's machined profile, so precision mounting surfaces on sides and bottom, and accessories and additional options are also available. Talk about innovation. The Integral V linear guide system was developed to reduce cost, increase application flexibility, and for ease of installation. Now this is really unique. For manufacturers that are using aluminum structural framing, this takes a lot of cost and a lot of time uh, installing a linear motion system. And I'll tell you how. We've got bolt-on and integrated and snap-in series of this integral V linear technology. And what that does is it fits right into aluminum structural framing and or mates directly to it by being a bolt-on application. You can also see here in the samples that we have the integrated models where the V-race is actually built into the aluminum structural frame. So taking a lot of steps out of application, or excuse me, of installation and uh, also cost. So this rail consists of a durable anodized aluminum with a precision embedded hardened steel raceway. So the Integral V components include various guide rails, snap-in clamps and carriages, each having high load capacity, rigidity, and torque resistance. So you're going to see a, a real flexible lightweight aluminum profile, low friction and breakaway force, no stick slip, 
uh, but joinable. Max speeds of 10 meters per second up to 12 meters per second is what we're testing internally right now. And then we've got some options for you. So this is the most versatile, most innovative, uh, original product that we have seen, obviously, and that our customers have seen in a very long time in linear motion. We're very excited about this addition. Thanks for visiting our booth today at the 2008 AT Expo. And if you'd like more information about our products, please visit our website at www.pbclinear.com. Thanks and have a great day.